Who's up here on stage with us? What? Hello. Hi, Haas. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. Haas from Franks and D's. Hey. Hey. Hello to you fives of people out there listening right now. Well, <laughs> welcome in Radio Land. Right. Uh, Thanks doing, for having man? me. What's Thanks going for, on? Uh, hanging out. Uh, this is going to be a really fun show tonight. The Nuggets, the Nuggets and Sheiks and Neptune oh. and Kang Tigers. This is so, going to be a very entertaining show. Yes, Most absolutely. Most entertaining show at Double Down all year. The only band I don't know is the Nuggets. They are from Japan. They play American rock and roll, a little bit skewed on the soul side of things. Okay. Uh, are you familiar, you're familiar with the Hayes? Yes. Right? Oh, yeah. So the, so the Hayes from Tokyo play like Chuck Berry style rock right. and roll. Chuck Berry and Ramones and stuff. Uh, the Nuggets are also a band from Tokyo playing American rock and roll, but they're more on the James Brown side of things. Oh, yeah. get on up. <laughs> dude, they're, they're phenomenal. We saw them here about a year ago. Oh, that sounds fun. Can't wait to see them again. It's going to be great. Yeah. We're actually playing a gig with them when uh, Frank Sandin's plays in, in Japan in uh, May. That is exciting. Yeah. Japan. Yeah. So are you, are you, sorry, are you big in Japan? I'm big everywhere I go. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of big things, obviously you don't think this is a big thing based off of our conversation, but I was uh -oh. recently looking at concert flyers coming up, and these motherfuckers are opening for Hinder, and they're we not did. excited about it. We did. It, yeah. already, it already happened. You already did. It already happened, yeah. That is amazing to me. Well, thanks. It was uh, random. We got called, can you guys play this gig? And we said yes. At, uh, I don't think, I, I think a couple of the guys from that band watched us play. We played early in the afternoon, though. But it was fun. It was a fun gig. I had pierogies. It was a delightful gig. Who doesn't like pierogies? Right. Right? Who doesn't like Hinder? No. Uh, uh, Besides so, you. So, radio.com. All right. <laughs> now, uh, speaking of food... Uh, you do have a monthly event called the Franks and Dean's Weenie Rose. Yes, we do. The first we Wednesday of every single month right here at the Double Down Saloon in Las Vegas, Nevada. Yes. <laughs> How many years has it been going now? Uh, just over five years now we've been doing Damn, it. Damn, that went by fast. <laughs> You're fucking telling me, bro. I, I remember the first one, and it's like, it doesn't feel like it was that long ago. It but. does not feel like it's been over almost 60, or no, over 60. Yeah of them now and we've met you know because of tours and stuff like that yeah. we've had to miss a couple here and right. there but i don't think we've ever missed more than two in a year you right know what i mean so of 60 plus we've only missed maybe uh, 10 of them tops tops so, that's really great yeah it's uh i well i missed one because i had to go play in japan with the bloodcocks uh and the scheduling got mixed up so i had yeah. to fly out while weenie roast was going on that was weird, but uh, but yeah, it's uh, it's been fun. And just so you guys know, free hot dogs, lots of tits. It's a lot of fun. A lot of oh, fun. Oh yeah. Can I still say that on this on this station? It's just uncensored, right? Uh yeah. Old we Steve, got the okay. Old old Steve's yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know what? Speaking about uh, firsts, that that was this woman's first time That's last Wednesday going to uh, the Weenie time? Roast. I definitely did. The, I will say you guys are definitely one of the best bands I've seen here playing at Double Down. Oh, thank you very much. Did you get a free hot dog? I did, and yeah. it was fucking amazing. Like, Fantastic. You I got don't, the whole experience. I don't know if I was drunk or what it was, but that was like the best hot dog I've ever had. We saw some boobs. It was a, it was a great night. Who, I, who doesn't like tits? That's the question. I actually today was looking because I've realized that everybody who does music or like is related to this place, we all kind of have each other on Facebook for some reason. Not complaining, but I was watching the videos from Franks and Deans. I missed all the best dancing. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> you wait, you watch the videos and what? I saw the videos of like the dancing that was going on, uh. and I was in the back, so I didn't really see it. Oh, but I see. Because you got to get up front. Yep. Come on. It's, I, uh, it's definitely a get up front kind yeah. of experience, right, Quincy? You yeah, gotta be, it is. You got to be up front to really get the, the full experience. Oh. This, is, this is Quincy over here and his gaggle of, gaggle of Texans 
Uh, they come in. They come in all the time now, to hang out with us from Texas. Yeah, I recognize him. Uh, I've seen him here at your shows. Is he gonna make it rain again tonight? I don't know. I don't know about that. <laughs> It depends on how it went at the po- in the poker room, I think. Oh, okay. Oh, the po- hey. <laughs> I just turned nice. around. And as, I was- he, as he walks out. <laughs> <laughs> I just turned around and there were like dollar bills flying. I was like, what the fuck kind of show is this? I've never seen this it's, here before. It's, it's a fun show. It, it really is. was. It's a, it's, a whole, it's wholesome family entertainment. <laughs> I, I enjoy it every time. <laughs> we enjoy it every time we play it. It's, yeah. it's, it's our favorite. I mean... We sometimes have had to cut tours short, you know, when booking them because well, we got to get home to do the show. You know, it's right. it's it's printed in our albums. The first Wednesday of every single month at the Double Down Saloon in Las Vegas, Nevada, for Frank's and Dean's Weenie Roast. Yeah. Like yeah. that's it's our gig, and we'll be doing that for as until I physically can't do it anymore. Which I mean, likely you got a while. What, it's, uh, just, it's only been five years, six yeah, years. We're I fine. don't know if this engine has five more years on it. <laughs> Hey, you know what? On that note, uh, tell us a bit about. Uh, so you just did a tour. We did. We just yeah. did a tour. Uh, we went out on Ow. the road with uh, a band called the Horror Pops. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. They were a lot of fun. They were a lot of fun. One of my favorite bands to begin with. I have always loved that band, and they uh, they've been on hiatus for over a decade. So this is their first tour they've done in years, and it was just fantastic. But they. They sold most of the shows out, and uh, the ones that weren't sold out were... I'm sorry, are we interrupting something? <laughs> <laughs> They're getting rowdy at the bar. They're getting rowdy at the double down. Let's hear it, guys! Yeah! <laughs> These people are ready to party. This I hope is a excited. partying crowd tonight. I hope, they're exci- I hope they're excited and bring that energy to your show, I man. certainly hope so. I certainly hope there's yeah. not nine people on their faces <laughs> in the next ten minutes. Yeah. <laughs> hey, it happens. Ask <laughs> you. <laughs> but Woo! yes, we did. Uh, we did the tour. The the horror pops. They're already our family now. They treated us very nice. very wonderfully, and and they're just great people. Danish, Danish folk, and they're uh, they're a blast to hang out with, and and a and a blast to tour with, and it was a really really great time. Nice. Hopefully, we get to do it again sometime soon. Yeah, that sounds like fun. I wish I could go on tour, see the country. You can, man. Yeah, I got to come yeah. up with something. <laughs> Anybody can go on tour if you got, you know, a no van, bill, <laughs> uh, no bills to pay in a van. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's that it's that stuff at home that always puts a, puts a damper on things. But, yeah. But uh, honestly, like, it's the most fun. I think for me, and it's not for everybody, but I think I can speak for for the band. It's the most fun anyone can have is just being on tour, playing music every day. It's oh yeah, it's the most fun thing there is. It, uh, meeting new people every single day, and like it's kind of like Groundhog Day. You do the same thing every day: load in, play, load out, ho- hotel, load in, play, load out, hotel. But your surroundings are completely different every day. So you're doing the same thing. It's the same schedule, but you're in a completely different town. In, yeah. a, in a whole new world today. You know what I mean? And waking up in a, in, a, in a place that I've never been before is exhilarating. It's the most fun thing ever. Nice. You know? And, well, then you uh, go to, and then you go to a place enough times and you start making friends. You start making friends in a town that you never thought in a million years you'd ever even go to. Yeah. I, I, I've been, That's interesting. I've been fortunate. I've been, met people all over the globe. And I never thought I'd get to leave my hometown of Boise, Idaho. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, Boise, Idaho. Oh, well, there it is. You yeah. know, we're, we're kind of in the same area. I grew up in uh, Eastern Washington. Yep, you sure yeah. did. So it's kind of like so you Napoleon know exactly Dynamite sort about. of small town. Yeah. It's yep. crazy to be like where we are now, right? Yeah, right? <laughs> See, it's not crazy. I was uh, born and raised here, so. Ah, oh. spoiled. Spoiled. <laughs> hey. Spoiled rotten. Yep. Yeah. So uh, for for those here that missed Wednesday night's weenie roast, they're going to get a taste of it tonight. A little bit, yeah. A yeah, little yeah, bit, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, minus the weenies. Minus, minus the weenies, weenies yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, uh, and uh, we'll just have Nicole dancing with us this evening. Usually at weenie roast, we have bring in other entertainers. Yeah. Of oh, that's talents. But, uh, oh, hell yeah. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Did you just say just have Nicole? Come on, Nicole's amazing. Sure, but I was just comparing it to the Weenie Rose show. Yeah. She does a wonderful job, and we love her dearly. 
Well, uh, fuck. Uh, let's just uh, one more last thing. Merchandise. You're gonna have uh, all your albums available tonight, or uh, absolutely everything. Okay. Everything's available on, uh, and we have a a very nice web store at franksanddeans.com for anybody out there listening. I got one of the T-shirts. It's cool. Yeah. Uh, you can get like what else? Oh, all kinds of things. We have very, uh, CDs and T-shirts and vinyl records and. Stickers and buttons and patches and coasters and and uh, poker visors and yeah. fans and, po yeah. and posters and various marital aids, lubricants, cock rings, that kind of thing, <laughs> all kinds of stuff. Everything you need available tonight. Everything you need yeah. at the Franks and Dean store. <laughs> right. Uh, well, everybody will be able to check it out. Uh, among those things is the new album, Surf and Turf. Right. Yes, yeah, sir. We took. Uh, our normal formula of taking a Frank Sinatra era crooner song and making it punk rock, we kind of turned that on its ear and did uh, all punk rock songs as instrumental surf tunes, like 50s style. Yeah. And uh, and we recorded it with a guy named Deke Dickerson, who's a guitar hero guy and, uh, and just a, a great human being. So we went out to California and made a record with him, and he did a cameo on it, and it's uh, it's been doing really well. We're very pleased with it. Nice. So, yeah. uh, cool. interesting, That's... interesting little story, if I may. Yeah. So we have three albums out. Uh, our album release party for Surf and Turf we did in Richmond, Virginia, at a place we played a few times called Wonderland. It's a really, really cool place, and uh, and I happened to sell the very last copy available of our first record at the album release party for our third record. I just thought that was a bit serendipitous, you know? Wow, like that's what a tie-in, yeah. Yeah, right? You know, that, was the, that, that one now is unavailable. You cannot buy that record anymore in a physical copy. And we don't know if we're ever gonna repress it. We have no idea. It's gonna, hey. Yeah, we'll see what happens. You never know, yeah, that's yeah, awesome. We don't know what the future may bring. I love it, Haas. I love you. I'm so, I'm so glad for you guys. Thanks, pal. So, uh, Frank Sedins, everybody, check them out tonight. They're playing here along with uh, the Hi, Nuggets, Daddy. DK and Tigers, and Sheiks of Neptune. It's, Daddy. it's a taste of what you get from every first Wednesday of the month. What is it called? The Fra Franks and Deans Weenie, Weenie Roast. Roast. Yay! Yeah. Get some wieners in your mouth every Wednesday. Put them in your mouth. Well, first every Wednesday. First Wednesday, yeah. yeah. So, uh, well, we're gonna play. Uh, we're gonna play this song from Let's your album. Yeah. What is this? Uh, this American is uh, this Jesus. is our take of bad religions, American Jesus. Sweet. Here it is, everybody, and uh, we'll be back with more right here on Double Down Radio. Who are we? We are Dust Devil Radio live here at Double Down every Friday, eight to ten p.m. Yeah, let's do the thing. All right, folks, can I get everybody in the bar to raise their glass? You guys at the bar that were getting rowdy earlier, now is your time to be fucking rowdy. Over in the corner, over in the corner. Let's see those drinks up in the air. Come on, folks. Come, Come on, on, birthday folks. girl, raise your fucking drink. Put them up, yeah. put them up, put them up, put them up, put them up. On the count of three, I need everybody to read this wonderful fucking sign behind me. One, two, 